What's going on, guys? It's Acti. Today, we are at Looney's Pub in Fulton, Maryland, which is somewhat in the Washington Redskins slash Commanders fandom area. And uh, yeah, we're going to be talking to some people, asking them who they think we're going to pick for the draft. We've got some food. We might do some food review. And then uh, we've got the Kino. Uh, and a creamsicle, but we're here. The draft starts in 36 minutes. We're pick number two. We're hoping for Jaden Daniels. We're going to see what everyone else thinks. J.J. McCarthy. Emmy thinks J.J. McCarthy. I doubt it. Emmy's got insider tip. We have no clue. We have no clue. Yeah, hopefully we don't live in quarterback hell for much longer. Hopefully we select Jaden Daniels and we have something exciting to watch this year. But all right, let's get some food. What is it like? Crunchy, crispy, super, super hot. I'm burning everything, but delicious. All right, who am I here with? Ray Lynn. And this is Carter Lynn. Are you a Redskins fan? Well, Commanders fan too? Are you a Commanders fan? Who do you think we're picking tonight? Do you know? Do you know who's in the draft coming up? Have you looked at any of, like, the people that we might pick? No. No, not yet? Jalen Daniels. Jalen Daniels. I want him. If we don't pick him, we suck. Even if it's a one-year show or whatever, some people are saying that Drake May is like the, the better long-term pick and that Jane Daniels might be better day one, but it's not going to last. I'd take another 2012 over again. Dallas fans, you all suck. Oh, yeah. Who do you think we're picking tonight? I have to go with Jane and Daniels 100%. I hope to God that we choose Jane and Daniels. I'm going to be very sad. I think Drake May is kind of I like, what's the point of drafting Sam Howell? He's like Sam Howell 2.0. He's a little bit taller. As, long, I'm, as a Commanders fan, I don't want the Giants to get Drake May. As long as they don't get him. I think it, who picked? after us I know that I know the fourth pick is gonna be Marvin Harrison to the Cardinals but somewhere in there is the Vikings and then the Patriots and I think that in my opinion I think Drake may goes to the Patriots with the third pick in the 2024 NFL draft the New England Patriots select Drake may quarterback North Carolina if Drake it, as long NFC East, no I don't want any good players to be going to the Giants what is that? There's a, there's a championship ring over there. Hold on, I, there's a Super Bowl ring or something. There's a Washington Nets ring. Yeah, that's crazy. He's the executive assistant to the traveling secretary. And gave away on Saturday. Uh, we were having a conversation off cam, yep. and uh, I was trying to think of like what questions I could ask uh, other fans, because really the main video is about uh, Redskins fans and like who we think that are commanders, whatever the fuck. Nah, that's yeah, cool. Not who we think that we're gonna pick or whatever. But then I had the thought of like, are you are you more worried about a particular quarterback, or you don't really care? You were kind of saying. I, I really don't care, honestly. I mean, at the end of the day, I know that you guys got half of our team. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, coaches Quinn, included. Your defense is going to look great. Offensively, you guys are going to have to figure that out. Running game looks great. Eckler was a great Hell yeah, people are How sleeping. about them Redskins? That was a great pickup. But at the end of the day, I'm going to be honest, as a Cowboy fan, I've been saying this for a while. Like, I was always, shout out to Romo, that's my quarterback. Man, I'm not, oh, a, big fan. I'm not a big fan of Dak. Granted, it took us a long time. It took us a long time to figure out how money moves. We have overpaid quite a bit. I mean, we paid Albert Haynes worth a $100 million contract. This this, this was, yeah. he's worth it. He's it worth was every dime. That's that not, we, as I said, he was, he, him. him and what, uh, well, other than my man that got hurt, what was the tight end? Jordan Reed. Good God, man. If he could have stayed on the field, yeah. that's like, like freaking, what, Antonio Gates style. Like, he was really take over. He killed us. I mean, you, everybody knew on the field, it's third down. Right. All right, it's third and four, and you're playing against us. What are we doing? You're going Jordan to, uh, Reed, and, and Jordan your Reed, whole defense route, knows it. Three route out, four route out, or he's doing a scene. And it's still going to work. Sick. I'm here, even though I'm a Cowboys fan, born and raised from DMV, DG stand up. Got to get those guys. Hell yeah. Out, man. Damn, so you're born here and you yeah. still chose Dallas. Dude, I'm also a Duke fan, so. Damn, you're really, you just like to start things. You're trying to start fights. No, I like to have good conversations. There you go. Yeah, I mean, it, it, here we are. So, but it was nice meeting you. Your Likewise, name was? Delonte, man. Delonte. He yeah. also does photography. Yeah, I'm going to pop up your Instagram. Shout sure. out this guy. Call the Shots Images, the way it sounds. C-A-L-L, Shots Images. Oh, I do a lot of film. Um, I do a lot of photography, uh, wedding photography, children's birthdays. Hell yeah. Uh, headshots, paws. Uh, you know, you will not catch us at a Diddy party anytime soon, bro. Listen, you won't even catch me at no Diddy party. I'm trying to run this bag up. So I think that the only two real answers to who we might pick is going to be Drake May or Jaden Daniels. Obviously, JJ McCarthy has been brought up a couple times. I don't really think there's a high chance. I, I don't think I'd be very surprised if JJ McCarthy adds to or even a trade back. I don't see that happening. I think for the Commanders, as an uh, unbiased e uh, Eagles fan, I think Jaden Daniels is the better fit. I think Drake May, under the right circumstances and more patience, could be the better prospect and better quarterback. But 
If I was a GM of the Commanders, I would go Jaden Daniels. So. You go Jaden Daniels. Okay. Are you more worried about Jaden? I, I I think like that flash in the pan as a rookie. I, I do think I wouldn't be surprised if it's like another RG3 rookie year. I think Jaden Daniels will be a better setup for you guys against us personally. Do I think you guys will beat us? I don't know, but Jaden Daniels. I was one of the people that wanted to keep Sam Howell. Yeah. When we traded him, I was like, all right, well, let's at least, I think Drake May is the guy or whatever. And then yeah. and then that was really before watching tape. There's there's really bad tape of Drake May struggling against NC State and Virginia yeah. Tech. That's a good point you brought up because uh, I think if Drake May was really the pick, I think what you guys would have done is kept Sam Howell. Uh, Sam Howell, who's already been there, done that, let him deal with all the stress of having to build up an offensive line and bring in Drake May. So that I think us getting rid of him and then trading for Mariota was like all of our cards on the table were picking Jaden. And, and picking, picking Mariota is a perfect point. That's how Philly handles their backup. It's so that there's a seamless uh, switch between one and two. That is, this is badass. That is really cool. That call, I, I, I picked up on the sound. I was like, what the uh, fuck? Was I'd be very surprised if Jaden Daniels was in the pick simply by the moves that you guys made. Sam Howell being traded away, and then the pickup of uh, Mariota. Uh, do you have anything you want to shout out or anything like that? Oh, uh, man, yo. I just want, I can't wait for the football season to come back. Like, all love. Can't wait. Hell yeah. yeah. All right, have a good night, man. Hopefully you guys get who you want. Hopefully we pick Jaden Daniels. All right. So we are the the it's official. There's eight minutes and fifty five seconds on the clock for the Bears. Uh, they're gonna pick Caleb Williams. We all assume, and if they don't, that would shock the world. I think. So the Bears are on the clock. They're probably gonna select Caleb Williams. We we got a couple answers. I didn't get as much as I would like to have per se in terms of quantity, but the people I talked to actually gave a lot of like info and stuff. It was good to hear from a Dallas and a Philadelphia fan as well to see like who they were more afraid of in terms of who we might pick. Why do they have ten minutes on the clock if they know what they're gonna pick? There we go. So the draft the draft room is celebrating over in in Chicago. So their pick is in. We're about to be on the clock. I'm nervous. Like, I'm actually, like, have, like, a little heartbeat going. Traded their pick. I can already tell no, you. they didn't. All right, here's the Chicago Bears. Caleb Williams. Okay. No way! You didn't see it coming? No. All right, so, yeah, no, wait. So I was right then because we've only got six minutes on the clock. So that means that when they put their pick in, we were on the clock. So we've been on the clock for four minutes now. I am going to be upset if we pick Drake May. I'm like going to be visibly know, upset. You get whatever that other guy is, so you're going to scream and freak out. So we are four minutes away. Man, if we mess this up. I'm going to just give the mic to another Redskins fan real quick. I can't bring the camera because it's kind of heavy. Are you nervous as fuck right now? I'm like dying. I'm a little nervous. I'm hoping it's Jaden. We'll see. I am nervous. This is a big pick. New regime, huge pick. God, this is bad. I hope we don't fuck this up. Here we go. Oh, Adam Peters is on the phone. He's on the phone with whoever we chose. They didn't pick Jaden Williams. Well, we don't know yet. No, the pick is in. Pick is in. He's in. No, he's laughing. He's smiling and he's happy. He's cheesing. There he comes. There's Roger Goodell. Dun, 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 ding dong. With the second pick in the 2024 NFL Draft, the Washington Commanders select Jaden Daniels. Yeah. Quarterback, LSU. Woo! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Everybody's happy. Woo! We're excited. We're excited back here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm so excited. We're going to have somebody. He's the most recent Heisman Trophy winner. It's going to be fun. I'm so excited. Look at him try on that hat. I'm going to have to. Yeah. Oh, look at that. So they're showing Cajun High School. All of all of his all of his high school buddies are cheering. I went to college with Jaden Daniels, and he was in my uh, creative writing 101 class. And he sucked. He never came to class, and he was always late. I went to LSU, LaSalle oh. University. Well, I guess that's the video. No crying mob of people who uh, are mad about Drake May, but I'm happy for that. There's a bunch of Eagles fans, Giants fans. Everybody's getting along though here. It's not too rowdy. We'll probably, uh, I might just end this portion here. If you guys haven't seen last week's video uh, ranking the Redskins first round draft picks, it's part one. Part two is going to be releasing after this video. If you guys haven't seen last week's video, please go check that out. I spent a lot of time on it. I had to split it up into two because of how much time I was spending on it. I wanted it to come out before the draft. 
and this, the part two, so it's going to be that video was last week. This video is as you're watching it. Uh, next week's video will be part two of the Redskins tier, uh, the the draft tier, and it's the it's going to be from 2000, whenever I left off, all the way up until our, our most recent Jaden Daniels. What what my first impressions are, and just more hype about him, pretty much. So, but the Arizona Cardinals pick is in. Yeah, oh, there they are. So, all right. Well, that'll wrap up at least this part of the video. I might do something when I get back to the house. Other than that, thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.